Hey, what's up? I'm YouTube. Today I'm gonna show you guys a little bit how to make ringtones for free off of this program that's called Audacity. Yes, Audacity right here. Well, today first of all I'm gonna show you how to download a program. You open up a web browser, any web browser. Type in Audacity, A U D A C I T Y. Hit the enter button. Go on audacity.sourceforge.net. Double click that. If you have Windows, you download from the Windows. If you don't have Windows, um, it doesn't matter. Just click on Download Audacity. Um, if you have um, Mac, well, to download Mac section. But I'm going to show you how to do it in Windows. So you're going to need two things to download Audacity. I mean, to actually make a ringtone with Audacity. You know? You're going to need the actual... Pro, um, program and you're gonna need a lame mp3 encoder so first I'm gonna show you how to where to download the, the program itself you click on um, actually sorry wrong one that's not the right one you click right here it says audacity 1.2.6 installer exe file you click on this one right here um, and when you click on that um, this loads up you gotta wait for this it says your audacity download will start shortly you wait patiently if you have patience just be patient then you click the run button and this will download the exe file onto your computer let that download um, I don't think I, I should tell you how to do that I think you should already know how to download a file by hitting the run or the save button if you don't you shouldn't be using a computer anyway um, back alright not that far back but go back with one page hold on go back to this page right here um, and then download the lame mp3 encoder you're gonna need this in order to um, encode um, mp3s and stuff so you're gonna have to click lame mp3 encoder then you have to go to click lame download page it's gonna take you to this page download for audacity on windows lame underscore version 3.98.2 for audacity on windows.exe you download this click on it you should know how to do this like I just said and that should that's about it that's all you need to download and when you're done downloading that you just get out the web browser and you open up your audacity now when audacity pops up what you want to do is you want to click, click the file button and you have to open up an mp3 file this the song has to be in mp3 format don't try to open it up in mp4 don't try to open it up in windows media audio it's not going to work it has to be an mp3 format it has to be an mp3 format sound i mean song so please um open um like i have songs from my limewire if you want to download from limewire or wherever youtube whatever you want to download just go ahead um, let's see what good songs I got on here that I probably could download. Let's say Jay Z, right? DOA. Well, it'll import the MP3 from my folder onto the thing. It loads it up, and then you hit the play button, and it starts to play the song, right? All right. Well, since I want to, I want to hear the chorus part because most ringtones have the chorus. I would look for the chorus. So keep on clicking until you find a chorus. And uh, look, keep on going. Hold on. Uh, let me pause this right quick and make a comeback. All right. Um, I found a part of the chorus that I like. Um, I liked it right here. So this part right here, you want to zoom into the song when you get to the song. But you want to zoom in, you know, not too much, but just enough. And then hit the play button. And then what you want probably want to get is a minimum of like 10 to 20 seconds, because if you have like a uh, like a cell phone that has like a low amount of um a low amount of memory just make it like 10 or 5 seconds 10 seconds for me it will be okay so what you do is you click on the part of the song that you want and you highlight it and make sure it's like 10 seconds that's about 10 seconds right there the way you make sure you know that's 10 seconds is right here you see this part right here that says that's next to swap to off is right here this portion right here tells you the amount of minutes that you highlighted. So since I highlighted 
10 seconds it shows that I highlighted 10.5222 seconds so it shows you your seconds or the minutes or whatever that you highlighted right here after you highlight that you want to play it just to hear what it sounds like you see that right there that's what your ringtone is going to be that's what you want your ringtone going to be so what you do after you do that you probably want to um trim you click edit button then you click trim right here you see trim you click on edit then you click trim and after you click trim you click export as mp3 now here's where the tricky part comes in a lot of you guys might have something saying something that says oh well you can't download this because we need a lame mp3 file or whatever just that's easy all you have to do before you save anything you you want to go into the computer section well don't do what I'm doing but like when the little screen shows up on y'all y'all screen y'all have like a little screen that shows up when you want to say something for the first time it only shows up once it'll be like we need to find the file that you that you're looking for but this is the folder that you want to go in your computer your local disk C then you want to go into your program files and then you want to look for a program that's called lame for audacity it has to be this one here that you download lame for audacity you double click on it and then you look for the file that's called lame underscore enc dot dll now this is the file that's associated with the program that allows you to trim songs and and take in, take out certain portions of songs and turn it into an mp3 format so you want to double click on it and whatever and then for you guys when you double click on that it will come it, this screen here will, will show up it will say save mp3 you see it doesn't show up for me because I don't I'm not using yeah it's basically not a, that file I'm using is just supposed to be associated with a certain program so just opening it up like that for me wouldn't usually work so anyway yeah this will show up and then you want to want to click save to your desktop the best place to save is, is to your desktop click the save button and it's exporting the entire project um, and that's about it it says Jay-Z DOA there, there's your ringtone see that's the ringtone right there um, I don't have to hear all that so basically now what you want to do is get your ringtone from the computer onto your cell phone so what you do is you gotta go back and open up your web browser um, go to a website that's called text for the, the the number four free dot net it's all one word text for free is all one word and then you click um you go to this this is what the page looks like text for free dot net um what you want to do is type in your phone number right here type in put in your whatever your cell phone carrier is Verizon if you have a Verizon you click Verizon T Mobile whatever you want um make sure you type in a message it wouldn't it, it can't send a file unless you don't send a message so you gotta put like whatever just put whatever there just put a hi or uh, love or put your name or something or whatever and then right here this is what you this is what you really want to do you want to choose a file but the thing with this with this website is you could only send a file that's one megabyte in size so make sure your ringtone is less than one megabyte or or one megabyte and then what you want to do is choose file and then look for the location of the file since the file was on the desktop you would click that and then like Jay-Z DOA where your song would be on the desktop this would be your ringtone you just click on it type in the numbers or whatever you know type in the numbers and, and all that good stuff and then click the send message and it would go through when you type in this, ca this catch right here it goes through so image code provided does not match the one in the bottom well see this didn't go through for me because I put in my information but when you send it it would be like your file has been successfully sent and then you'll get and then within like not even a minute like within 30 seconds your your cell phone will be ringing you got a new text message you open it up you hear the song playing you, you click the the whatever it is you save the song as a, a ringtone you know you know basically that stuff so I mean that's it I mean that's all that's all it is um so thank you for watching um, this was a Kadeem 121 on productions all the copyrights the uh, Jay-Z DOA goes um 2008 Rockefeller records that's not mine so that's copywritten material that's not my property 
or just using it to make a video not claiming it as my personal video because I know YouTube is getting very strict with that so any um, copyrighted material in this um, process of this video is not mine so thank you for watching this has been a Kadeem 121 production Kyle copyrights goes to me but all copyrighted material in here goes to the, the rifle owners so thank you for watching and have a nice day rate comment and subscribe